本格的にお相手しよう Him. Wow, this is so high energy. Hello, everyone. Wait, let me let me make sure these captions are working. Um, it's taking a second again. I don't know why it likes to do that. <gasps> I forgot my controllers in the other room. I'm gonna be right back. Sorry, y'all. I'll be right back. Acquired my controller. I should plug it in. Oh my goodness. But how how is everyone doing? I hope everyone's doing well. It's midterm season for me, so um technically this is a part of my midterm. But oh! Echo Eddie, hi! Yeah, Space Channel 5 is so good. Like I I I've played this before and beat it like once, but it's 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 just really good. I enjoy it a lot. Um I'm trying to remember wait, I'm also gonna skip this the rest of the song because it's it's making me get distracted. Um let me see. I'm gonna just play the opening song. There we go. Okay. But yeah, um I hope everyone's doing well. It's midterm season for me, so I've been a little busy. But a part of my midterm was for my streaming class to like make a plan of what I want to do for the rest of the semester. And I, I want to just analyze rhythm games. 
both of them. They're just my fave. Um, and so we're going to start off with Space Channel 5. I'm not sure what we're going to do next after Space Channel 5, but the plan is to do Guitaro Man, No Straight Roads, Project Diva Extend, um, possibly DJ Max, Respect 5. Just a, like we're, we're doing a bunch. And then by the end, I'll be talking about my rhythm game that I've been working on called Skate and Date. Um, and also just how that came to be and like show prototypes and stuff. I don't know. I thought it would be really cool to do that. Um, yeah, sorry. I'm getting a little distracted because I'm like, dang, I need to, I need to start like scheduling these posts or something. Cause having to, um, sit here and be like, we're live now at twitch.tv slash Jensuda. Yeah, Project Diva. I love all the Project Diva games, but my personal favorite is, um, Project Diva F second, but I don't have my PS Vita. Like, I got home one day and I've just never seen my PS Vita since then. And my little sibling has one, so technically I could use theirs, but like, I also don't have um, the thing or whatever I need to stream for my PS Vita, so that's okay. Um, I think I think we're just gonna jump right into it. Let me let me stop the music. If if none of y'all have seen what Space Channel Five, oh that was your first Project Diva, nice. Yeah, I my story with getting into um Project Diva is so silly. I was like at my grandma's house one time, and I was on her computer, and I I was like seeing a live performance of World Is Mine, and I just went down a rabbit hole, like on YouTube. And eventually saved enough money on Amazon to be like, oh my gosh, I I too would like to um, play Project Diva because I had a PSP um, and I, I didn't know about region lock, but also the PSP wasn't the region lock. Thank goodness. So I played the very first one. I did buy the second one, but um, it they sent me the first one. So I ended up giving it to one of my high school friends. Um, and ended up just emulating the other PSP ones. I played, I've played all the Project Diva games now, which is kind of wild. The 3DS one, all the PS4 ones, the arcade one. I finally got to play the Project Diva arcade machine last year. Um, but yeah, I am a big fan of Miku. <laughs> I guess is the best way to put it. All right, so Space Channel 5. Um, oh, I forgot there are some flashing lights. I should put, I should add that to my, um, my title. Let me, let me see if I can just do that from here while this cutscene plays. Um, but yeah, 3DS one had Gumi. We need more with Gumi. Also, I don't know if there's supposed to be English subtitles at all for this game, because even when I first played it, I was confused. I was like... How am I supposed to understand what's going on? I know that's the guy from the first game. But, yeah. Ooh la la, she is a, a space news reporter. She's really, she's really cool. And she be dancing. Um, while this plays, hopefully this doesn't break. I just want to. Oh, uh, 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 OBS didn't like that. Okay, give me a second, folks. I just want to make sure I just have a small content warning in my title, just being like, there are some flashing lights, and I don't want bad things to happen to people. Um, here we go. Stream information. Um. Uh. Content warning. Um. Minor flashing lights because I do remember unless maybe it's more Guitaro Man I'm thinking about just a lot of rhythm games have a lot of flashing oh my god <laughs> Michael Jackson was in the first one I I'll have you know I haven't played the first one I've watched gameplay of the first one um also, if the audio is too loud, let me know. I want to make sure the audio is good. Um. Oh yeah, I'm assuming these are all from the first game. <laughs> Space Michael! Every time he appears, that's what bothers me the most. He's in both games! 
games. I didn't even know he was in the first game. Alright. Health check. I'm gonna take a sip of water right now. I should have refilled my water during the starting soon. Oh! Why is the screen dark? I'm gonna hit start because it stopped. Oh! Yeah, no worries! Have a good time lurking. Hope you're having a wonderful day. Um, I feel like I should turn the audio down just a little bit because it's loud in my ears. So I'm wondering if it might be loud, like, in the stream. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. I don't think I can turn it down here then. Okay. One second, everyone. Da -da 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 -da. Da -da 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 I need to go to my little volume mixer thingy and just turn down Space Channel 5 just a smidge. Just a smidge. Auto stream is good. Oh, okay. Okay, cool. Awesome. Um, I'll just leave it then. But here we go. We're gonna, um, oh, oops. Okay, there we go. Wait. All right. We're going to, hold on. Trying to figure out why it's the okay. It's not showing you the screen. It doesn't matter because on my screen screen it says search for some reason. All right, but we are gonna do story mode. Um, we're just gonna do it from the top because it looks like you can play it again. And um, I don't know what second. Oh wait, Second World has new characters. I think I'll think I'll do it just for fun. I'll just do the second world just for funsies, but I'm pretty sure it should have the same story and stuff because it plays the same. And I'll make sure not to skip any cutscenes. But yeah, another part of me, whoa, playing these games. Oh god, yeah, that's ooh. Another part of me playing these games is just like um, I want to analyze how um, the narrative of the games tie into like the rhythm game mechanics because that's something that I focus on with Skate and Day at least and so I don't know just analyzing how it is in different games like people choose different things in this game it's just a bunch of normies that like music um there are some things in this game that definitely has not aged well um like Space Michael so, like, just so pale. So pale. But well, we're not, we're not even there yet, so I'll be quiet for now. The music slaps, though. I love the soundtrack for this game. But yeah, this game is just about saving people from being forced to dance. <laughs> Gotta go save people. As a news reporter. Here she is, Ulala herself. And like a lot of people are talking are just people from her news team. She has a little news team. I think what sucks the most is like I can read Japanese a little bit, but I could not read more than Ulala. I think there's like little caption thing. Yeah. They're dancing still and we have to save them. The way they dance, though, still kills me. Alright, I might not be very talkative now because I gotta focus.
What I think is also interesting is just like how... I think it's interesting how Rhythm Games just kind of stemmed from Simon Says. Like... Ooh. Like, Space Channel 5, obviously. Parappa the Rappa. I would talk more if I wasn't so focused on being like, I want to get a perfect. I'm too much of a perfectionist. But as I was saying, like, it's interesting how a lot of rhythm games just kind of stem from Simon Says, like, you know, the kid's toy where you're just pressing buttons. Or I like Bop It as well. And then how some games, like, when we get to Guitar Man, kind of turns it on its head. Which I think is interesting and cool. It's just like, I can do what you can do, but better. Our TV ratings gotta go through the roof! Dang. Okay. Oh yeah. Hi, Grouchy Ghost. Oh, yeah, people speak English sometimes. I hope you're having a lovely day. If y'all have not taken a moment to follow Grouchy Ghost, um, 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 hope I can do this. Oh, God. That was... Please. Thank goodness. The last time I did this, I did not save everyone. Wow. <laughs> oh! I shouldn't speak so soon. Oh god. Okay. I was luckily my like um my little phone text stuff like had your username saved so I was like yes if you have not followed Grouchy Ghost go follow them they stream a lot of Fire Emblem related content if that is your thing we're also playing Nosha later which is more of like a murder mystery with time loop shenanigans well not a murder mystery but it's a mystery game. <laughs> You're about to stun on him. Honestly, seeing this makes me think- Oh! We need more Space Channel 5 fan cams. God. mixed up so much! Oh, shoot. Okay, I did it. Aha! Get over here! 
we have saved the, the, the sexy dancing Taurus lady. And I say that because this, 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 this I just, man. But I love this so much because it's also like everyone's like dancing against their will. And then when they get saved, they're like, all right. Oh. It's more like a community thing. Like, we're gonna fight together with our killer dance moves. Like, also being on the news too. Like, that's a lot. Also, I'm going to, my brain might be, mm, because boss battle time. Gosh, here we go. You know, thinking about narrative stuff again, I think it would be interesting. Oh wait. I think it would be interesting if people got like perfects on everything except for bringing people like with them. Like that sounds like it would be lonely as hell. Just being like, I here I go, doing all of this cool dance stuff by myself. Except there are people that you get. Like, on purpose, obviously. Chew, okay. I was like, mm, mixing them up, mixing these things up. Oh, oh, we're done? Are we? Oh, right. Oh, I remember now. No! We are not done yet. I also think it's just interesting the cutscenes. Oh! Like all the lyrics and stuff are there just to, for distractions. And it really uh, works for me! Because I will get distracted. Lord knows. Jeez. Go, gosh! <laughs> A barely passing rating. <laughs> this is Space Channel Five. I got everybody. What? No secrets. I don't know how these secret things works. I would think I should like. I'll probably search it up after beating the game as for a second time. But yeah, I feel like that's the really interesting thing. Oh. But I think it's a really interesting thing because there are some other games that do have like secret- Oh right, I can choose what I want to wear. Wait, can I- can I see? I won't- Oh. Oh, right, this is a flower costume. Mm. Super Ulala. Oh! Okay. Ah, over three hours of game time? 
See, like, I, I feel like, oh my god, there's, like, specific things that I'm like, yeah, oh, right, other people, um, <laughs> I'm a child, I feel like, hmm, like, for example, how I was talking about Project Diva earlier, that's a game, like, where I usually go and try to unlock everything, everything. But Space Channel 5, I just never tried to do that. Um, not that it's bad, but it's interesting. Wait, am I ready? Can I go? Okay, it's cutscene time. We can't hear anything because that's just a little, little alien speaking. Um, yeah, the... The mayor? Or the president? I don't remember who he is. He's important. Uh. Uh. Oh, is he gonna sing? Gosh. 